Okay. Mm -hmm. Right, so we just gained that really important system. So, probably, yeah, I should make an outpost over these uh, primitives. Okay, if we have a look at the policies and edicts. So I should be able to do all of those, but I think later on certain factions, maybe the Xenophiles wouldn't like me doing certain ones. Uh, I could conquer these natives, potentially, and uh, I don't think... Well, they would definitely be annoyed by it, but the other two probably wouldn't with their ethics. They might be. Can't remember. They are slaving their spots. Um, yeah, so I'm not sure what I'm doing with those primitives yet. Okay. I think I'm going to come up to there. I want to get that. And that's pretty much the borders on that side. So, yeah, at that stage, I've pretty much got the borders then that I want. Construction complete. But I may start expanding beyond that, even though I won't be able to easily protect it with base star bases even when I get the FDL drive. Um, because more territory is more territory is a good idea. I can colonize this backfill at any point really. There's some issue with pirates forming here, which uh, they can if I don't uh, get it soon, but uh, it's not a big issue really. Ah, here we go. So this is what I was talking about earlier. Uh, because he was a slave, I've now turned unfreed him, or freed him, I should say. Uh, he's still annoyed at having been enslaved. So for some reason, it wasn't immediately working when I colonized. Probably because I had just immediately done it. Gives you a bit of time. But um, yeah, it's a bit of an issue. But it uh, shouldn't be too bad. We're getting a ton of bonuses for things like traditional communal. Uh, Spiritualism, getting a bonus for the unity, so that's great. Uh, right, saving up for colony should begin. Pirates coming down, and I'll have a quick look at chat. Okay. Uh, right, new contact. I think I probably end the stream in about half an hour. I'm thinking them out. So, new contact, new communications, and uh, we found the platypus uh, creature type thingy majigami here by the looks of it. They are peaceful traders. So we've found all like normalized empires, no specialized one really yet. Uh, they in theory shouldn't be too much of a threat. Where are they? So we found two more peaceful ones and uh, two more aggressive ones there. Uh, right, so they probably wouldn't be much help in a war against them, and, but you never know. They're weary. Oh wow, their fleet power is inferior already. I definitely put it on hard difficulty, didn't I? Uh, someone would have said if I hadn't. So... Yeah, I'm really surprised at that. They could go after them, and the fact they probably should be going after them when they're inferior. If they were inferior, I would definitely be thinking of declaring war and declaring war soon. Okay, survey is done. Uh, right, the survey down there. Receiving communications. Okay. Right, he wants a non aggression. I don't see much point in me signing a non aggression with them. Cause maybe I could go after them at some stage. Oh, yeah, we don't have a border. Um, the only reason, really, to 
Some of the non-aggressions to do deals like the research treaty, but it's not exactly far ahead. Um, yeah, I don't really... Well, it might be worth doing a research treaty if I don't give him one myself. But there's nothing stopping me from doing that already. So, I don't see much reason to uh, yeah, do that currently. I mean, what you reckon in chat? What do you think? Is there a good reason? You have to let me know. So, if you think there is. Uh, a research treaty, though, was viable there, though. And I, yeah, I think I might come in there and uh, splash a few minerals. I mean, if I could get one or two check techs a bit cheaper that he has, I uh, get 25% bonus on attack or reduction on attack. It's kind of worthwhile for, yeah, probably. Okay, so um, let's get Colony ship out first. Let's get what else was I saving up for the capital building over there? Minerals at the moment aren't really getting much more because of uh, consumer goods and the ship upkeep. So I still need to improve on that. Okay, uh, let's get the colony ship on then. Uh, right, this one. What do I want here? Energy credit, a massive boost. So I think I'm going to want the main population type. Let's make them here. Sacrosanct. Okay. Now... Uh, it's some really good stuff there. Well, actually not in one big yield. I'm right, gonna move that on, I think, first. I'll pick that territory up next. Start getting some of this. And yeah, like I keep on mentioning, I need to get a capital up. There. Sphere of influence expanded. Okay, that's not in a great place. Um Right. Briskly is done. Excellent. That's four colonies. Let's put it there. I don't like how it places uh, things currently. It's, I think it's supposedly down to how near it is to the capital. It gets confused. And I wish it would just do it in the order you colonize it. Or you could have an option about how it does it. So, right. Currently, I probably need some food coming up. I'll put them on there for the time being. Construction complete. And observation post is done. So let's have a look how this works now. So standard option, eight monthly gain. Aggressive option, I would have to turn those options on and you get ten monthly gain. So it's not exactly much more at all. Um, and if you do that, you tend to turn um, xenophobe. So if I wanted them within my emperor at some stage, that would be a bit of an issue since I'm not xenophobe. Uh, that one, that switches them to your ethics. Monthly cost of energy, monthly gain, less six society, that's eight. That one gains control of the home system in a non-military manner. That one... Uh, what does this do? Prepares for annexation bias. Very expensive that one is. Don't think that's worthwhile doing, frankly, by the looks of it. So, yeah, this population type, I think I'm happy at the moment just to get the extra society. They... Yeah, really aren't all that great at the moment. So I'm going to just keep on getting the society off them. I may annex them at some stage or do something else. Uh, what do you reckon, chat? What do you think I should do there? Right, I think I need about 300-ish for this new capital building. Anomaly found. Let's do that. 
Okay, but scientist. My fleet coming down here now. Right, they're almost reached there actually. Uh, that debris, I should hopefully be able to get it just before it runs out. Okay. Starbase, but no real issue with that. Uh, so I'm not going to continue down domination, I just don't like it. It's not that useful for me at the moment. Just needed it to get the influence. So the Spiritist faction hasn't come in, which requires harmony, so I'm not going to pick that up yet. Yeah, I think I need the habitability, especially since I just found two really big planets that need extra 10% habitability. Uh, I'm going to head off towards there. Uh, diplomatic influence cost. Reduced and trust growth increased. Uh, yeah, I'm going to go down towards that habitability. It's going to be pretty important, as it turns out, potentially. So, that takes me up to five. Not too long a time afterwards. I think I'm going to colonize both of those. Now, I'm going to get... The knock yields aren't going to be so great. And also, happiness is going to be more of an issue. But I should be able to colonize with my really good species and longer term I can always terraform that world into a world that they happen to like so it's yeah gonna be fine uh, right let's see some combat then a little bit and that's pirates dealt with and this time let's if I did forget last time which I don't know did I forget chat you'll have to let me know uh, yeah, let's go and take out these station here. Okay. Star system charted. Right. Uh, that's done. Let's come up to there. Okay. So I think. With the settings I picked, I did a default empire, amount of empires. There's going to be 12. There's going to be three foreign empires, I think, and two marauder empires. The marauders can't get a uh, special can happen until 100 years into the game. Uh, luckily, we're not next to any of those marauders, which is good. Uh, but, well, who knows? I haven't surveyed some areas over here. There could be a Marauder Empire over here for all I know. Okay, uh, nearly have enough to get this. What do I need? One more month. Okay, and it seems to be there I settle on. So let's demolish that. And yeah, I got plus one for mineral, food, and energy. Extra governor, traction, defense, armies. So yeah, two energy is good, one mineral. Happy with that. So okay, let's have a quick look at chat, see what's going on. Okay, chat's gone really, really quiet. So uh, yeah. Uh, got anything to say, chat? Uh, let's get expanding my territory again. That should be in place. Right. Oh, uh, that's over here, and looks like I can move it onto there. Okay, should get uh, some booty out of that. See what the pirates have. Receiving communications. Ooh, and that reminds me as well. I want to uh, get a research agreement on these guys. They want to swap communications. Not interested in that. I don't want them knowing about others, really. Because uh, attacking enemy assets. They might benefit from it. Okay, let's have a quick look at this then. 
did get Ishtam in time, so I got some progress on science and yeah, research. Uh, excellent. So there should be another one there actually now. Okay. Pirate station raided. 300 minerals this time and 150 energy. Very, very nice. Let's go and repair that. Uh, right. So they're actually more efficient than me, but um, yeah, easily dealt with. No losses. Uh, right. Okay. That mineral certainly helps. What can I do with it? So let's get that. Right, let's have a look to see what leaders I can potentially get. No one there I'm interested in. Uh, governor. No tile clearing one there still. Uh, okay. Here, I probably need to clear a tile pretty soon. Let's do that one. Right. To get one of your population types on both of these at some stage, which means I need money for a settlement. Uh, right. Okay, let's get that. That society is really going to help from that. Get some key text there. Okay. Anomaly found. Let's do that. Construction complete. Uh, right. You can see now I can actually have another star base uh, because of own systems. I think. It's roughly about 20 own systems before that increases one, I think. I'm not sure if that's the same on every map type. Uh, yeah, let's qualify, find out. So, uh, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20. Yeah, so I think uh, pretty much right about that. Look like it. So... Yeah, let's uh Hulks vivisected. Oh, when did I get that in? Just now is it? So let's go and colonize here. Another planet. Best energy tile is that one. The only one I think. More debris. Now was there any more? Lots of stuff to be done here. Maybe I should start doing it. Uh, I'll get that in first and then start doing some of the society ones. I've got afterburners in. I uh, could get the fusion missile upgrade. We got some of this from Debris. I don't think I'm going to research either of those yet, although I would like that armor action. Perhaps uh, I can get more Debris from more pirates later on. That's worth, well, yeah, pretty crap in my opinion. I guess I get the fusion missile upgrade. Not a great option so far in there. Uh, right, the scientist. What am I doing with you? Uh, what was the cap aliens? Was that. Okay, I'll do that one. I can't remember what it was. Maybe it's a white cloud over there. But if it's. Um, Potential for influence from a sieve, maybe I should do it. Let's um I they grew there. Don't really want them blocking there, but of course I could take it later. Oh let's get that, I think I can do that one. Okay. Not within my territory. 
Sally? Tile blocker cleared. Okay. Great. Construction complete. Uh, right, star base is done there. So, um, yeah, I may well be fortifying that one oh. coming up. Uh, in fact, I think I'll make it now already. The first upgrade. What's here? No good yields. I'm gonna bring that back because I think there's some good yields here. Let's come grab that. Okay. Construction complete. Ah, uh, research station. Special project complete. Okay, ocean beneath the ice. Uh, we got extra society from normally there. Uh, not in my territory, though. And we got void clouds. Now, if my memory is correct, with spiritless for this. Uh, basically, if you do that, you end up uh, causing unhappiness in the population for killing them. So I'm gonna do that. I'm not 100% sure I'm right. It's been a while since I last checked the. Uh, wiki entry on this but um, yeah let's do that I think this may even give happiness action oh this one needs physics to do rather than society so I might do that now okay let's have a quick look at chat probably streaming for Star I know we'll see charted. I said about now didn't I half an hourish before Probably stream for a bit longer, about 20 minutes, I'm thinking. Then we'll call it a day. Uh, right, let's survey here. So the start's Star definitely slower charted. with the changes in Apocalypse than it was. I don't think it's massively, significantly slower, though. Um, I mean, arguably, I could go to war now, build up. Um... Yeah, if I was next to them, I definitely could, because they were inferior before. Oh, that reminds me, I want to get a research cream, but now I keep on forgetting. Right, I'll save a couple hundred minerals and get that. Okay. After I got that. Uh, I should probably start focusing on minerals a bit more, actually, this is a bit low. Easily done. Uh, I've got all the mineral upgrades here. Okay, that guy. One might a stronghold on this one. Oh, he's on the food, which I didn't mean. Skim there. Um, let's. Do I need one of those and one of these? I probably do. So. Okay, let's resettle this guy on to here. Uh, stick him there. Okay, just about afford it, but I could do it more engine at the moment as well. Right, pairs done. Special project complete. Uh, yeah, extra happiness for doing this option. I think it's the opposite of the other. So that's going to be nice. Happiness will help with energy. It will help with science. It will help with unity. Uh, if you get to a certain threshold, which uh, I actually am with some of these, the green ones. So I'm getting... If I look at the yield... 7.5% for this guy at least. 75% happiness. Okay. 
Construction complete. Let's get the society and then we'll get this research cream. Construction complete. Governor, just gain architectural interest. That's pretty good. So they have wrong one. Yeah, extra slave bonus production, and also the buildings now going to cost less. Okay. Right, I think I might move that guy as well onto here. So let's stick him on there first, which means he's a slave. And because he's a slave, he will be cheaper to transport. Alright. 50, half. Excellent. Okay. Colonization in progress. Alright. That's good. So, um, right. Let's see how much this research agreement is going to cost me uh, with uh, these guys. Who. Oh, that's not good. Uh, these are starting to get superior. Yeah, I was surprised earlier that we were equivalent, frankly. Uh, they're. Bonuses are starting to come to play perhaps a bit more. Uh, luckily, no one's. Uh, well, the only one that really matters, honestly, completely matters, is fleet power. And uh, yeah, no one's superior now, so that's what really. Yeah, what I care about. Uh, Offer trade. Oh, uh, do I want to give him that? Not really, honestly. If I can avoid it. And I should be able to avoid it. He's giving me a really piece, uh, cheaper deal here, 100%. Okay, let's get every penny out of it. Um, I could do it longer. Yeah, I think I'll do it a bit longer. I mean, the AI's got so many yield advantages that you should get decent way ahead of me in tech, so... Let's do that for 19 years. Not expecting to come down here and conquer him in 19 years. Star system charted. A bit longer than that, though. Who knows? Uh, survey system. It's done. And... Terms are reasonable. Excellent. 19 years worth of research for a measly 100 on minerals. That sounds like a great deal to me. So what happens now is basically if he has any other tech sign research, I get a 25% boost towards them. So say I had 20 research, it would be 25, it would act like. Uh, as it happens, none. it doesn't have any of those tech. So that research agreement at the moment is absolutely worthless to me for those techs but it's bound to have something I want Anomaly found. coming up uh, I did have more techs to me uh, this guy has the Roma trait construction complete which is that service speed I guess is pretty useful uh, one of those scientists actually got up to level 5 so maybe I want to start doing some hard level Anomalies, actually. Okay. What am I saving up for next, then? So, there's a couple more colonies up here I could go and grab. Uh, probably need to get more minerals, actually, and more energy at the moment. The science is pretty good. Technology secured. Right, got that really good builder. Pretty expensive, but very good. Uh, next, I'm going to go for the growth speed. Uh, yeah, my population growth is pretty slow at the moment. And even, well, it's the default now, but yeah, it's taking a while. Okay. 
Oh, that came in. I didn't realise. Let's put someone here. Right. Uh, let's clear. Mm. That's rather expensive. Let's clear. Ah, wait on that bit. Construction complete. Oh, well, I get it now. I want to put that uh, slave processor in there. Uh, research, research station there. Let's get that energy. Get that one then. On the shoulders of a giant. There's an on the shoulders of super giants in endless space too, and they're both getting that quote from uh, is it Einstein? I always forget. Uh, talking about Newton or something. So adds the X planet and others. Right down there. Have a quick look at chat. Uh, stream is fine. It was getting ready for work. Thanks for streaming. See you next time. Cheers, says Ernest. Thank you, uh, Ernest. Uh, thanks for watching the stream. Uh, right. Let's continue on for a little bit. Okay, I think I'll basically play on now until Star there's something interesting to end it on. Uh, system mm. surveyed. Uh, let's go on the survey up there. Uh, right, that's waiting for minerals as it happens. Okay. What do I want here? Right, let's get that physics. Okay. Anomaly found. That's a bit too much. Right. Construction complete. Serban uh, Starbase up there, okay. So there's four star bases now I've got. Haven't started upgrading them at all. Yeah, until the FDL interdictor comes in, they're not going to be super useful as defensively, so that's kind of the key point when I'll upgrade them a lot, especially if I am think I'm at risk of being invaded. Uh, to be honest, no one really seems to be... Well, no one's making any claims, and none of them are... Yeah, that much of a threat at the moment. It's a massive source of science there, uh, there's a lot of minerals there as well, so I might oh, and there, so I might want to grab those, even though they're not really uh, that useful in ex expanding my borders, taking territory away from other empires. Right, this scientist, can I do that? This is to Anna. Okay. Tile blocker cleared. Uh, I want to save it for that new building. Construction complete. Let's. Uh, do I want? Yeah, I guess I want a power plant here. Right. Recon and research vessel under attack. Well, that's pretty interesting. The Ether Drake has been encountered. Ominous. Tactical retreat. So, where to are you? This is a uh, Leviathan from the Leviathan's DLC. Uh, yeah, not going to be able to do anything about that for some time. Uh, can't make sense of that. Now, the Ether Drake usually goes crazy. Probably try and attack me if it can. And that's a level 5 leader there, so I hope it doesn't. It missed because uh, 
Yeah. It's got a lot of evasion probably on it. Uh, right, got lucky. Terra firma. We have finally reached the system of Sol, a destination some being went to great pains to communicate through a very primitive medium. The plaque's point of origin is seemingly the third rock from the sun, which should be a continental planet. You shouted into the void and we came. AT influence ends the solar coordinates event chain. So I think that was probably the Voyager, a nod to the Voyager uh, plates from the 70s. Uh, right, let's go and check that out. Okay, so, yeah, and of course, we know that, uh, something happened to the third rock from the sun. Uh, and, uh, oh, that remain a cockroaches, but looks like it. So, let's go and, uh, oh, we're still doing that, are we? Right. Let's go and grab that. And grab some more energy over here. Okay. Construction complete. Uh, research station over there. Right, that scientist. Uh, oh, there's a couple of things over there. Let's go and grab those. It's a level 5 scientist. I should be able to do just about anything now. Let's put them to work rather than surveying. Uh, engineering is really low. Let's go and grab that uh, while we're here. Oh, actually, it's on a planet that can be colonized, so not so great an idea. Uh, let's come back here grab that amazing mineral source when I have enough minerals which I do now. Star system uh, I'll come down there as well. So I'm basically now at the extent of uh, in every direction where I wanted to put my choke points, my uh, star bases. Uh, yeah. But I may want to expand beyond them. In fact I definitely will at some stage. It's just a question of when. So I could backfill this now or keep on expanding uh, various locations. Um, it looks as if it's just this empire over here. So there's a lot of territory between us. So I, yeah, it may be definitely in my interest to start coming up here, frankly. I think there's a decent chance I will start expanding up into here. So at some stage, what my defense is going to be like, it's almost um, like a castle of concentric rings, if that's the right term, or, and uh, yeah, a fort, so if you, in a war, if I lose the outer ring of defense, it's like, get past the moat, then I would have the battlements at that stage, and then they may keep complete. at the final stage, obviously I wouldn't want to lose a war to that extent, but I think that's what I'm going to be doing with my... Uh, star base to a certain extent if I need to which at the moment it doesn't look as if I need to and uh, they're not that much stronger than me uh, mining station is made and of course the, yeah the many mentioned times uh, the FDL inhibitor is going to be crucial to that because they'll be able to get past my fortresses if I don't have it but um, a number of techs away from getting it 20 to 50 onwards, I probably have a chance again. Okay. Technology secured. Another physics tech en route to get it. So, I would like the energy grid, I think, at this stage. It's a pretty nice energy building. Or, I could pick up the sensors which I actually have a bit of progress towards uh, yeah listening post is going to be very good and sensors for the ships in general sensors are much more important now 
Uh, so I could put listening posts on those fortresses there, star bases, and look into the territory and find out how good their fleet is. And based on that info, I may even be able to attack them. So uh, because I got some debris, I can research this at any time. So I think that's pretty important. I'll get that first. And I might get this next if nothing too decent turns up. It's going to be the plan. So they got four colonies now. How are we looking on here? This superior. Oh, okay. Uh, I need to increase my fleet size. That's not great. So they're coming up in power all of a sudden. Um, yeah, not great. I might want to start. Well, I definitely need to increase my fleet size, basically. Construction complete. So let's do just that. Uh, I haven't gotten too much. Yeah, my engineering complete. tech hasn't been too good, and uh, a lot of the ship-related stuff. I need engineering for us. It's a bit of a problem. Pirate treasure, very nice. Ton of extra energy when I was pretty low. Okay, about to get the fifth colony. Want to colonize those two relatively soon. Uh, can get have to build I need in less than. Four years. Okay, new contact. Okay, the Rex Flat Galactic Hierarchy. Okay, pretty nice looking dragon there. So, uh, right. More slave and death spots. Where are you two? They're down over here. So they could be a potential ally against them and potentially against them. How many empires have we found then? So one, two, three, four, five. There's seven more. Uh, fallen Empire, and then there are the Fallen Empires, and then there are Marauders as well. Uh, right. Oh wow, this might be the advanced start based on how well they're doing. Can't get a non-aggression with them. They were it can't get with them. They were as well, okay. And the only ones I don't want a non aggression with are the only ones I can get non aggression with. Uh, I might want some of the others. Uh let's get that then. Okay. That was uh yeah, five percent. Construction complete. I thought I had to go back to the home base. I guess I didn't. Oh well, that's probably costing me resources actually, which I didn't realise. Um. Yeah, I should really think about building a shipyard here. Let's get some more minerals. Okay. Uh, I could probably make a temple here. Star system charted. Okay, uh, my station survey. How much for that? Two Construction five. complete. Tactical retreat. I actually got a lot of influence, I've been forgetting this. So, automated shipyards, counter, deal with the aliens. 
uh, automated repair. Uh, some of these I would like to do, but it's a case of. Uh, yeah, I don't want to spend society on them. Is that actually doing this? Or are there loads of those anomalies? Uh, rinse that. Can... I think I'll hold off on the physics science there a minute. Uh, let's get some more minerals and whatnot. Uh, actually, I want that, so let's go and grab you. There's no engineering in my territory. Some there. Definitely want to come down there at some... St oh. No, that's just that. Construction complete. Okay. No AI is making claims on me, so it's highly unlikely that they would uh, be to claim war, even if they are starting to get a bit stronger. They're those guys and they're superior on fleet, yeah, so I definitely need to increase my fleet size. Uh, it's an employed citizen or two. Okay, let's stick you there. Uh, that guy can go there for the time being. Um, what am I looking for? Construction complete. Uh, make that there. Right. Surface queue there. I'll save that for another Corvette. Sphere of influence expanded. Excellent. That's colony number five. Growth speed, which I desperately need. Finally got that. Uh, Society's doing all right, actually, so I don't desperately need the bio lab. Don't really need star base capacity quite yet. Uh, do I have any volcanic worlds? One tiles. Uh, three. Not four. Uh, not massively so. Just a couple there. None there. It's quite expensive, so I could arguably hold off on that. I think I get the bio lab. Oh, actually, do any of do I have a bo proper bonus from the other AI for this? No, I don't. Okay, yeah, I'll go for the bio lab, even though I don't get a great bonus nom. Um, yeah, non guy there. Ransom is emergency boy. Okay. Could be a trap or clean up transmission. I'll go for that. Right, so let's do that. Research. Science. Okay, let's come up here. Let's have a quick look on chat. Okay, uh, right. Special okay, project so Ransomers SOS. Uh, right, so this is a pretty interesting quest. I've had it before. So Ransom, yeah, Ransom, Ransomers SOS. The boy has been verified as one of the sacrosanct, one of sacrosanct make, and a signal it's relaying has been stabilized. So I can shut it down. No one speaks this. Lose 50 influence. Does it sound great? or uh, open comms. Sacrosanct authorities, identify yourselves. No video feed. Ha hello, this is the captain of the Luxion, a sacrosanct civilian transport. Uh, former captain, the Luxion is gone. We were boarded by pirates and taken captive before they blew up the ship. So, number of options here. Who captured you? They I I think they call themselves the Ransomers. The Ransomers. 
At any rate, they're a vile bunch, but uh, we'd all be dead already if they didn't think they could get something for us from the Order of the Illuminated. I've overheard them discussing their demands. So we have an option to uh, not rescue them, and presumably that might actually have an event. Or we will rescue you. Uh, what do you reckon, chat? Any... Uh, any thoughts on this? I imagine they're going to probably say you should rescue them, actually. So, uh, we are Xenophile as well, so, uh, yeah, we really should help them out. Should know if we're going to play with the ethic uh, type in mind, which uh, I will definitely do so sometimes. Or well, if not, quite a lot. So, um, yeah, we will rescue you. Oh, thank you, thank you, Grand Illuminator. We're being held in some space station, but I have no idea where we are beyond that. I will increase the transmission burst now. It should let you triangulate the location of this prison from the emergency buoy. Position recorded in the situation log. Okay. Uh, right, there it is. Track on map. So it's in the DM system. And yeah, let's get my uh, fleet over to there, I think. So that's where my ship currently is. Do I have enough for another corvette? I did mean to make one right, a couple of shorts. Uh, that I'll have follow uh, the main fleet to join up. Okay, and this science ship, let's do what with you. Those level 4 anomalies are probably too much. Let's level 1 here. Let's get uh, this one over to there. And I think that might be a pretty good place uh, to end the stream. So next time round, I'm, we'll get to see... Uh, basically the outcome of that event if we get to uh, rescue those captives or if uh, something else entirely is involved with that event and uh, not is all as it seems okay so uh, right uh, have a quick look at chat uh, just like to thank you for watching then guys uh, especially if you've watched the whole thing I've been streaming now for five and a half hours I think actually uh, although it took about 10, what, 15 minutes before we got set up uh, properly. Uh, yeah, so I hope you've enjoyed the, yeah, the Let's Play, the stream. And uh, yeah, I'll be continuing to stream much, much more of this. And uh, yeah, the really interesting stuff with uh, the new features really start to come into play in the uh, mid game and uh, towards the end game with Apocalypse and Cherry but having said that we've seen yeah a lot of the changes already the whole border system the rework is very different hyper lanes only and uh, yeah that takes a bit of getting used to but uh, yeah war is definitely gonna be on the cards it's just a question of uh, when uh, hopefully we get it some war in the next stream uh, but uh, yeah, I'd just like to thank you for watching again and uh, remind you if you want to help support the channel, you can do that via becoming a Patreon or uh, via Super Chat now or in the future. And uh, hopefully, I'll be uh, streaming some other games soon as well. I want to finish up that Endless Space 2 Let's Play that I was doing. And uh, I'm not sure when I'm going to stream Stellaris next. I may stream again maybe tomorrow or the day after but I kind of would like to get uh, these up to YouTube arguably before I stream again but uh, we'll see what I'll do I'm not deciding but yeah that's it then for now thanks for watching and I'll see you next time